Hello everybody and welcome to back to this. Let's get that away. Anyway, so a couple updates ago they decided to do a thing called the Hero Reborn, which I didn't originally play when they released it and I didn't start playing till again until like a couple days ago before they did the uh, Hero Reborn for two more characters. But the Hero Reborn I'm very happy about because they changed around all my favorite characters back to the way I liked them before they did the year the revamp skill tree to the weird one that was one on left and one on right and really weird and I didn't like it. But for this video I'm basically going over the changes to the infinity sword and then I'll go over the rune slayer next because I don't have a lord knight yet. So first before we actually start the dungeon where I show it this is new skill tree I like. As you can see it tells you your good skills you want and you can choose traits now on specific skills these will modify the skill but you know they also have like a power like 100% accurate critical hit but Thor's that card that's what I'm saying still I think it's an overall increase though because critical hits are double damage whatever and now every t and they've changed it so every five levels you get a new skill no I have not reached 65 yet deal with it but I'm happy about this because basically I now have my original Infinity Sword back, well, almost back, all the way from when they released the Infinity Sword. So that makes me very happy to use, and I'm totally going to use this guy because I love this guy. So let's go eeny meeny miny here on normal. For one of the, well, one of the bigger changes to the Hero Reborn. Right, let's get started. Yep, they speak English now. Fine. And I'll admit, when I first heard the English, I was like, whoa, okay, what? But I wasn't using my... Yay. But I wasn't using my Elsword, I was actually using my Grand Archer, and she's talked English because I was teamed up with a friend of mine, and I was like, okay, um, what? Also, that's the greatest thing Elsword says now. He's just become Scorpion from Mortal Kombat. Like, really? But as I was playing this playing with my Grand Archer before I knew they changed the voice actors, and it was probably one of the greatest things they've ever done in this game. Also, they modified Swordfall so that it actually moves a lot faster. Personally, I think that's pretty decent. Swordfall was pretty good, but now it's pretty decent as well. Still good. Still good. <laughs> still good. Still good. Rage Cutter, still good. I love this new skill tree for each character, and I'm going to go over probably. Mm, what should I do next? I'm going to say Rune Slayer. Oh, yes, they also got a bunch of new combos because that move was. That's. What? What? Oh, he threw swords downward? We can do that now? I didn't know we could do that now. That's cool. I didn't know we did that. Go off the edge. You too. Thank you. Oh, no, not me. Dang it. I didn't want to go off the edge too. Oh, any new changes? Hmm. Oh no, I haven't really used the Infinity Sword much since. I mean, I used it in a couple dungeons, but I haven't used it much since then. Also, the new voice actor is pretty cool. I gotta say, between all of them, the only one like I'm kind of eh about is actually Raven, because he doesn't sound like Raven should sound like. Just. Officially, Raven is supposed to be, like, in his 30s, and he sounds like he's in his, like, late teens. So it's kind of not... Maybe that's just me being really, really picky about something. Oh, yes. I also chose the, uh, trait. That is, um... <laughs> increase the duration of Phantom Sword, because you can do that. And... It's... so good. Phantom Sword is a really good move for the Infinity Sword, and I just gotta say, having an increased duration of Phantom Sword is pretty good. You 
can die. Oh my god, the crits. Oh my god, the crits. Okay, excuse me, good sir. I need to murder this thing over here. Alright, now I can go back to murdering you. Now I can go back to murdering you. Okay, you're dead. Did I hit the guy behind me? Holy crap, what is the range on this move? Get over here. So I should replace it with just the void, the voice of the sparking going, Get over here! Oh, come on, really? That was hard to jab to fall down like that? No, you didn't, but you did anyway. Uh, nope, you died, please. Thank you. There you go. Let's use that. Did you really do that? How dare you? Try and build up to vitality mode while I'm in the boss fight. Should. Probably won't, but I should. Eh, maybe I will. Hello, Shadow Master. Nice to see you again. I killed you earlier today. That was it yesterday. I don't know. The days just blend together when I'm murdering these things. Good enough for me. <laughs> yep, this is uh this is the infinity sword. End this style. Okay. Really? He didn't move the entire fight. He hit me, I think, once. What? I'm sorry. What? Didn't I tell you? I never lose. Yeah, apparently so. What? He didn't move. Like he hit me maybe once or twice, and his little minion dude hit me, then his minion dude died as collateral damage, and he just died because he stood there and did nothing! <laughs> what? I so... <sighs> Alright, time. So this is basically the new Infinity Sword. Apparently you can stun log bosses. With a death speed. I didn't. That's just ridiculous. Alright, so, yeah. Uh, stun locking. Mosses is apparently a thing the Infinity Sword can do. <sighs> really? <laughs> Alright, any, 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 anyway. Uh, I'll move on to another character. <laughs> God damn <laughs> Really? <laughs> This is the easiest time I've ever had with a Shadow Master, like, ever.